you know, of course, Jimmy Smith is the is the world champ, as Jack McDuff used to just say, the world champ of the organ. You know, all the great guitar players came through. You know, with Jimmy, besides uh, besides Wes, uh, George Benson played with him, and it's there's a certain thing. I, I even got to play or, some organ in uh, in Omaha. Uh, there was a great organ player there named John Maller who also played p- great piano. He came back through town a little bit while I was coming up. There's something about the organ, guitar, drum hookup that's unlike anything else in jazz for the guitar because when the organ player who's kicking the bass with his left hand and his left foot, but a lot of people think the bass pedals that they're playing all those bass lines with their feet, well, in reality, they're playing with their left hand. That's where the main bass is coming from. And then they are accenting with with their foot on the pedals or on, you know, sometimes they'll, uh, on ballads, they'll maybe play it or medium tempos or slow to medium tempos, they'll double the bass line with their foot. But since the left hand is being used by the uh, organist to play bass, the right hand, when he's soloing, there's no chords. So that's why there's a there's that nice space in there for the uh, guitar to fit in. But not only that, there's something about that groove with the organ that's undeniable. Like Jack McDuff told me one time, he said, "Striker, if you look out in the audience and people aren't going like this when they're when you're playing, and you ain't doing your job." Um, he might have used a couple of swear words in there too, but uh, this is a family show, so we don't want to do that. You know, the, the, you listen to the records, and it just makes you makes you feel good. There's, you know. It just grooves real hard, and but you can also play as modern as you want with it, and it's just a cool sound.